in this video I'm gonna try to build the best racing game using features from other video games like Forza Horizon 5, The Crew 2, The Crew Motor Fest, Need for Speed Unbound and Test Drive Solo Crown. And yeah, I'm gonna be asking ChatGPT to help me build this game. Wait, why are people not talking about the Lotus Emira looking like the Lotus Evaya, but they keep comparing it to the McLaren Atura? Anyways, watch till the end to see what JetGBT chooses to make the best racing game. And also subscribe so we can reach 1000 subscribers before the release of Forza Horizon 6. I'm gonna start by asking you to choose a map from each of these games between Forza Horizon 5, The Crew 2, Need for Speed Unbound, The Crew Motor Fest, and TDU Solar Crown. Which one has the best map? So that's the first thing we're gonna choose to make our good game, our good racing game. So let's ask ChatGPT the question. Let's see what it answers. Oh, here it is. Now it's answering. When it comes to the best map, would you choose which one? Ooh you choose <laughs> okay if i had to choose based on variables i'll go with fh5 no i want to, to know what will you choose <laughs> got it if i were picking based solely on the map and the overall driving experience it offers i'll go with forza horizon 5 wow okay i don't want to go with forza horizon 5 to make the best game i think the crew 2 will be the best map to implement in the game like imagine the whole of united States, like a whole country and accurate cities like that's the best game you, you can get okay let's ask it the question again but for the best graphics now between fh5 the crew and unbound which one has the best graphics <laughs> starting with forza horizon 5 again i think chgbt is biased against the other games choosing fh5 number one when comparing graphics but okay this one makes sense this one makes sense out of all the games need for speed unbound and fh5 between those two the crew's not that good more of fast huh? and the game saying the visual are highly refined but it's a close competition with forza horizon 5 in terms of quality i don't think it's close okay the graphics looks good in motor fest but compared to fh i don't think it the crew motor fest kind of looks cartoonish i don't think it, it's close to forza horizon 5 okay it's saying fh5 reowned for its stunning visuals forza horizon 5 features a highly detailed and vibrant open world map the game rendering of different environments from large jungles and everything okay forza horizon 5 is the best has the best graphics between all this game but i think even need for speed unbound like who have you seen the, that game like the graphics are something else okay for graphics i think we have to choose need for speed unbound okay father is good but need for speed unbound it's another different thing let's ask it again another question which one has the best progression that is it's important to a game see a lot of people on the internet mumbling about progression that for the <laughs> okay now it's lying you see now it's saying fh5 features a well-rounded progression system with a mix of main story mission seasonal events okay okay i don't think so i don't think so i don't think so i don't we don't want a hmm, let me see okay Okay, progression progression is gonna be between need for speed tdu solo crown hmm tdu solo crown i don't like the crew too and the crew mode of it because it has two systems of credits I, I don't like that system i like a system where you just have one credit what, yes one credit things you have to ah no 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 it has, I, I don't know what it's called but that thing the money system in the crew huh that's need for speed and burn has or it only had one currency i don't i don't really know but the progression definitely not for the because people are complaining okay let's see it's saying fh5 generally stands out for its balance uh, okay for the run 5 is very balanced it's not hard don't have to grind hard can kind of grind hard but you know what i'm what i mean it's very balanced i think we're gonna choose tdu solo crown on this one the progression the grinding let's choose tdu 
and now it's time for the story mode of the game between FH5, the crew Need for Speed Unbound, the crew Morpheus, and TDU Solar Crown. Which one has the best story? If it says Forza Horizon 5, now I know the ChatGPT is very biased against the other games. Okay, it's starting with Forza Horizon 5 again. Okay, that's what I thought. It says Need for Speed Unbound turns out for having the most focused story and engaging story among these options. Its narrative integrates well with the racing gameplay and offering more immersive and character driven experience compared to the to the more event centric or backdrop narrative of other games. Yeah, event century that's what forza is and motor fares i think even the crew yeah i think even the crew okay story mode need for speed unbound so far that's the best one what can we okay which one has the best customization next which one has which one has the best customization which one has the best customization customization is key aspect of many racing games each title offers its unique okay here's the breakdown okay i don't think it's it's Forza, maybe the crew. This one is between the crew two, Need for Speed Unbound, Motor Fest. Okay, Solar Crown, not even close to Forza. But some cost some other customizations in in that game are cool, like interior customization. But the crew has interior customization, so oh no, look what it's saying. FA5 leads in terms of depth and variety of customization, in particular with this detailed performance tuning. And okay, tuning, we are coming to that. If customization is a major factor for you for the horizon 5 is likely the best choice among these caves <laughs> Are you having a laugh, mate? What? Forza Horizon 5 is the best option between the crew and Need for Speed Unbound. Uh, okay, I wouldn't choose Need for Speed Unbound because some other customization in this game. Like, I think customizations I'll choose. I'll choose the crew model first or the crew 2 because they're kind of similar. I think the crew has the best customization. Need for Speed, even though it has more options, but have you seen the cars in Need for Speed? Huh? Now I get it why manufacturer don't want you to customize cars in this game because some people who the customization you have in this game nope I wouldn't allow it either and another one which one has the best tuning system tuning system okay we don't have to read if it has a conclusion down there I think we have to go down there Forza Horizon 5 stands out for its exceptional tuning system offering precise responsive handling with extensive customization options to find tune the driving experience if you're looking for the best tuning system in terms of realism and control fh5 is likely to be the top choice among these games and i agree with that Forza horizon 5 has the best tuning system in out of all of these games the crew mode of first man okay maybe need for speed unbound but i don't know on the other side of realism because i saw a video of someone wanting to get top speed of of cars and he was using a car Ah, the Regera and the Lotus Evaya with real big wings and you managed to get a speed of 245 miles per hour like nah in Forza Horizon 5 there is no way you can get 244 on 245 miles per hour with a real big wing I don't think that's possible a custom real big wing I don't think it will produce more drag than giving you more top speed so Forza Horizon 5 definitely stands out I don't know about the crew but that game is kind of arcade okay so yeah tuning system goes to f 5 let's ask the question again which one has the best which one should we follow hmm. okay physics which one has the best physics in these games because physics is important very important forza horizon 5 stands out for its superior physics engine providing a high highly realistic and immersive driving experience if you prioritize detailed vehicles dynamics and environment environmental interaction for the horizon 5 is mostly the best choice among this game i think i agree with that one forza horizon 5 has the best physics like by far other games okay maybe the crew model first is slightly up there with fh5 but doesn't go past fh5 like tdu solo crown hmm. now the thing i don't like about tdu solo crown if you compare 
like when you when you pull the handbrake okay when you press the handbrake on this game just look how the camera reacts in fh5 and tdu solar crown I, I don't like the way tdu solar crown's camera kind of acts like i like it i like the camera to stand still and only the car is moving like that one is the best for me so physics definitely fh5 okay i don't know what's the name of okay which game has the best features like features like uh, you can turn on the light you can like those things let's see which one is the best which one has the best features i don't know what i can call features okay features like okay let me say features like opening windows and hmm, what can i say opening windows and windows and other features let me just say other features it will get what i'm saying okay let's go okay let's see which one it is yes and th that's what came to my mind test drive unlimited solar crown likely offers most detailed in car features okay they are called in car features including potential inter interactive elements like opening windows due to its focus into realism and luxury vehicles you are looking for a game with highly interactive car features and a rich attention detail to the interior of the car yes that's the best tdu solar crown has the best in car features like you can manually control your rear spoiler windows and the roof top of the car if, okay forza horizon 5 can do that i don't know about need for speed and the crew mode of fans. i think you can do it but tdu does it best so in car features game in car definitely tdu another one is the housing system in the game which one has the best housing 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 is this let's see which one has the best system i know what you're thinking and i'm also thinking the same thing let's see tdu solar crown again test drive unlimited solar crown stands out for having the most developed housing system among okay not solar crown because the feature will be coming later not now it's not yet in the game but even though they it not yet there but you have a hotel in the game which you can interact around around the hotel like you can walk around the hotel for the horizon 5 you have yeah just floating not really your character moving around the car in Forza Vista. The crew does kind of similar thing, but not in your house, right? Uh, around the festival, so it's kind of similar to Forza, but better than Forza. The Need for Speed Unbound. Oh, the crew too also help. You can walk around the house, and then you can even your character. You can even see your character. So, um, I think TDU Solar Crown housing system. Too. TDU Solar Crown already appeared three times on the list. Ah, which system again do we include to make the best racing game ever? Using ChatGPT. What other feature can I use? Okay, the car list now. Which one has the best? List. which one has the best car list? fh5 had 500 cars at launch wow whoa the crew too doesn't show how many cars have at launch okay need for speed and power definitely not on this list nah okay tdu mm. okay the best car list is for the horizon 5 definitely is for the horizon 5 maybe the crew model first says the crew model first is a new newer game aims to build on vehicle selection okay it offers a good range of cars okay but it's definitely not better than fh5 so yeah that's the list of the best game if like a frankenstein racing game if, if i may say so like if i was making a the perfect racing game the map i'll choose the crew to graphics between need for speed and forza horizon 5 but i'm leaning towards need for speed progression tdu story mode need for speed and pound doesn't have the best story mode if i had to choose between the need for speed i would say maybe heat oh the 2005 most wanted and then customization definitely the crew because okay the crew tuning system obviously forza horizon 5 the physics physics of the game forza horizon 5's physics the best out of all this game in car features test drive unlimited solar crown definitely that game in car features no no housing system the crew no not the crew i must say test drive unlimited solar crown even though it doesn't have yet houses so that's what i would choose because you can buy houses the car list obviously falls all right five has the best car list like if i 
variety of cars old cars new cars wagons like everything it has everything let me know down below which features you will choose from each and every game if you were to build the perfect game